Father, we thank you, we bless you for another glorious evening. Your mercy, your grace has brought us to. We thank you for protection. We thank you for shelter. Thank you for provision. We thank you, Father, for the blessings you have for us at this service tonight. Be exalted in Jesus' name. Lord, as we come before you, in any way we have sinned and come short of your glory, we ask that you will forgive us, you will cleanse and wash away our sins with the precious blood of Jesus. Fill us with your righteousness in the name of Jesus. Father, I hand over the service to you. Do according to your plan, according to your purpose in our lives through this service tonight. In Jesus' name, I have prayed. Amen. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. He has done great things. He has done great things in our lives. He has done great things. He has done great things. Bless his holy name. I say, let us bless the Lord. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. I know all that is within me. Bless his holy name. He has done great things. 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 He has done Great things, bless his holy name. He has done great things, 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 he has done great things. Bless his holy name. I want you to worship the Lord. I want you to worship the Lord because he has done great things. He has done great things in our lives. He has done great things in our lives. He's doing great things. He's doing great things. He's doing great things. And he will continue to do great things. I want you to worship him. I want you to magnify his name. I want you to adore his holy name. Is the mighty God, is the King of Kings, is the Lord of Lords, is Adonai. Worship and magnify. Worship and magnify his name. Lift up your voice this evening and worship the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. Elohim El Elyon. Mighty God, mighty God. Jehovah is his name. Jehovah is his name. Jehovah is his name. The one who does miracles, who does great and mighty things, is the way maker, is the way maker, is the way maker, is the captain of our life, is our good shepherd, is our counselor, is 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 is, is, is everything to us, is our sufficiency, is our sustainer, is the miracle worker, is the promise keeper, is the light in the darkness, is the mighty God. Magnify the name of the Lord. I want you to thank him. I want you to thank the Lord. I want you to thank the Lord from the bottom of your heart. Let everything within you worship the Lord God Almighty this evening and offer your thanksgiving 
your thanksgiving to him, what he has done in your life, keeping you alive, keeping your family alive, providing for your needs, providing for your needs, giving you the breath of life. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord. The Lord who is always nullifying the counsel of the enemy. And it's only his counsel. It's only his counsel that is coming to pass in our lives. Worship him. Worship him. Worship him for frustrating the tokens of liars. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord for confounding your enemies. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord for lifting you up, for lifting you up, for lifting you up, for blessing you, for blessing you, for blessing you, for turning things around for your good. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Let your soul, let your heart, let your entire body worship the God Almighty. Worship this God, the great I am that I am. The eternal King of glory, the only wise God, wise God. He has done great things in our lives. He has done great things in our lives. He has done great things in our lives. He's doing great things. And he will continue to do great things. Bless his holy name. Bless his holy name. Bless his holy name for the salvation of your soul. And, the, and your entire household. Bless the name of the Lord for coming to the knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ. Bless the Lord for, for, for sanctification, for Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit baptism. Magnify the name of the Lord that you are filled with His Spirit. God is dwelling in you and you are dwelling in Him. God is dwelling in you and you are dwelling in Him. Magnify, magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord because He knows you as His child. He knows you as his child, and you know him as your father, you're able to say to, to him, Abba, Father, Abba, 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 magnify the name of the Lord, magnify the name of the Lord, blessing, 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 bless his holy name, in Jesus' mighty name, we have worshipped, amen. I want you to open your Bible, so Galatians, Galatians chapter 5, verse 1. Galatians chapter 5, verse 1. In this freedom, Christ has made us free and completely liberated us. Stand fast then. Stand fast then. Stand fast in Christ. Focus on Christ, focus on him, and do not be hampered and held and sneered and submit again to a yoke of slavery which you have once put off. Which you have once put off. In this freedom, I'm reading that verse again. In this freedom, Christ has made us free and completely liberated us stand fast then focus then be steadfast then and do not be hampered and held and sneered and submit again do not submit again to a yoke of slavery the yoke of slavery you have once put off don't go and take on that yoke of slavery again. You only need to stand fast in Christ, to focus on him, to remain steadfast in him. Let us open to Isaiah 51, and we are reading verse 3 before we go to our prayer points. Isaiah 51, Isaiah 51, verse 3. For the Lord will comfort Zion, the Lord will comfort Zion. You are Zion. The Lord will comfort you. He will comfort all our waste places. And he will make a wilderness like Eden. 
<laughs> if you are going through any wilderness, this is the promise of God that it will comfort you and it will make your wilderness like Eden and a desert like the garden of the Lord. That is the promise of the Lord. Whatever looks like a desert, God is going to turn it into a garden, his own garden that is planting in your life. A garden not made by, by human hands. Joy and gladness will be found in her. That, that, is, that, is, that, is, that, is, that is what God is promising you from tonight. That joy and gladness from tonight. As you remain steadfast in him, joy and gladness will be found in her. Thanksgiving and the voice of song or instrument of praise will be found in you. Your glory, whatever, whatever has tampered with your glory, it will be restored to you. There will be no more wilderness. There will be no more desert. Just focus on your God. I want you to now say this prayer after me. Every evil weapon fashioned against my glory and that of my husband, my children, and grandchildren will not prosper in Jesus' name. Every evil weapon fashioned against my glory and that of my husband, children and grandchildren will not prosper in Jesus' name. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. No evil weapon. God has given you his promise. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. Any evil weapon fashioned against your glory and that of your spouse, your children and grandchildren, they will not prosper in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, tonight I call on you. Every evil weapon fashioned against my glory and that of my husband, my children and grandchildren will not prosper in the name of Jesus. Say after me, every strange, invisible power attacking my glory, attacking the glory of my family day and night. I take authority over you in the name of Jesus. Be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed. Every strange invisible power attacking my glory day and night, attacking the glory of my husband, my children, my grandchildren. I command you and I take authority over you in the name of Jesus. Be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed. Be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Be paralyzed. Be paralyzed. Your powers are rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Your powers, every invisible power, you are paralyzed today by the power in the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Anything covering my glory, say it after me, say it after me. Anything covering my glory from shining and that of my husband, my children, my grandchildren, I command you, be born to ashes. Be, be, by the fire of God, in the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer, pray that prayer, pray that prayer. Anything, anything from anywhere, covering your glory, your spouse's glory, your children, your grandchildren's glory, command them to be burned to ashes by the fire of God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, Lord, I call on you this evening that anything from anywhere, cover my glory and that of my husband, my children, my grandchildren from shining, I release the fire of God upon them and they are burnt to ashes in the name of Jesus. They are burnt to ashes in the name of Jesus. Say after me, every stubborn pursuer, every stubborn pursuer of my glory and that of my husband, my children and grandchildren, I command you to perish in the name of Jesus. Every stubborn pursuer of my glory and that of my husband, my children and grandchildren, I command you to perish in the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer, pray that prayer. Every stubborn pursuer, every stubborn pursuer, we are ever, we are ever they are located, whether near you, whether far away from you, as long as they are pursuing the glory of God from shining, from shining in your life. Pray, 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 pray that they will perish. Every stubborn pursuer of my glory and that of my husband, my children and grandchildren, I command you to perish in the name of Jesus. My glory, my glory, say it after me, my glory and that of my husband, my children and grandchildren will not sink. Our glory will not sink in the ocean of life. Our glory will not sink 
in the ocean of life. Our glory will not sink in the ocean of life. In the name of Jesus, our glory will shine for all to see, for all eyes to behold. In the name of Jesus, my glory, my husband's glory, my children's glory, my, Christ, my grandchildren's glory, I command you in the name that is above all names, the name of Jesus, awake, 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 arise and shine in Jesus' name. Say it again after me, my glory, my husband's glory, my children's glory, my grandchildren's glory, I command you in the name that is above all names, the name of Jesus, awake, awake, out of obscurity, awake, awake, out of obscurity, awake out of obscurity, arise, arise and shine and shine as shine as you have been purposed by the Lord in the name of Jesus. Our glory, our glory, our glory refuses to be covered, to be refuses to be caged, refuses to be hindered in the name of Jesus in any form, in any way. My glory and that of my children, my husband, my grandchildren will not be covered. It will not be caged. It will not be hindered in the name of Jesus. All barriers, all obstacles to the shining of our glory, they are removed out of the way. They are removed out of the way by the blood of Jesus. Every negative prophecies, every negative pronouncement, every negative statements and predictions made by anyone, living or dead, that is affecting my glory and that of my husband, my children, and my grandchildren um, to, be, to, to, to shine, be nullified, be nullified now, and be destroyed by the blood of Jesus. All your pronouncements, all your prophecies, all your negative prophecies, all your negative statements, all your negative predictions, they are nullified by the blood of Jesus, and they are destroyed by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Our glory is restored, and the Lord will be glorified in our lives. Say it, say it, say it, say it, say it, that my glory is restored. My glory is restored. My husband's glory is restored. My children's glories, my, my children's glory are restored. My, my grandchildren's glory, they are restored. The Lord will be glorified in our lives, in the mighty name of Jesus. I want you to pray that the Lord will restore the glory of this nation in the name of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray. Pray that the Lord will re restore the glory of this nation in the name of Jesus. Pray that the Lord will, re will, re will restore the glory of this nation in the name of Jesus. Pray that affliction will not rise, rise up the second time in this nation in the name of Jesus. Affliction will not rise up the second time in this nation in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray for the restoration of health, 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 divine healing, divine health to the city of Leicester and to the entire nation, to the entire nation, to the entire nation, restoration of health and healing, restoration of health and healing, the river of, of God's healing to flood this nation, to continue to flood this nation, to continue to flood this nation from city to city, from city to city, from town to town, from village to village, from hamlet to hamlet, in the mighty name of Jesus. I want you to pray for the renewal of strength, renewal of strength, Renewal of strength, renewal of strength and courage for the frontline workers and their families. Pray, 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 pray that prayer for the renewal of strength, for the renewal of strength for all the frontline workers and their families. Pray for courage for them. Pray for courage for them. Pray for courage for them. Cover them with the blood of Jesus. Cover the frontline workers and their families. Cover them with the blood of Jesus. Cover their work with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Let us now confess Psalm 23 and 91. The Lord is the shepherd of my family and I. We shall not lack. He makes us lie down in green pastures. He leads us beside the still and restful waters. He refreshes and restores our lives. He leads us in the paths of righteousness. For his name's sake. Yes, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, we will fear or dread no evil. For you are with us. Your rod and your staff, they comfort us. You prepare a table before us in the presence of our enemies. You anoint our heads with oil. Our cup runs over. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. 
and through the length of our days, the house of the Lord and his presence shall be our dwelling place in Jesus' name. My family and I dwell in the secret place of the Most High and shall remain stable and fixed under the shadow of the Almighty. We will say of the Lord, He is our refuge and fortress, our God. On Him we lean and rely, and in Him we trust. For He will deliver us from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover us with His pinions, and under His wings shall we trust and find refuge. His truth and His faithfulness are a shield and a buckler to us. We shall not be afraid of the terror of the night, nor of the arrows that flies by day, nor of the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor of the destruction and sudden death that suppress and lay waste at noonday. A thousand may fall at our side and ten thousand at our right hand, but it shall not come near us. Only a spectator shall we be as we witness the reward of the wicked. Because we have made the Lord our refuge and the Most High our dwelling place, there shall no evil befall us, nor any plague or calamity come near our dwelling place. For he will give his angels charge over us to accompany and defend and preserve us in all our ways. They shall bear us up on their hands, lest we dash our feet against a stone. My family and I shall tread upon the lion and adder, the young lion and the serpent shall we trample underfoot. Because we have set our love upon the Lord, therefore will God deliver us. He will set us on high because we know and understand his name. We shall call upon him and he will answer us. He will be with us in trouble. He will deliver us and honor us. With long life will God satisfy us and show us his salvation. In Jesus' name, I have confessed and believed. Amen. I want you to now cover yourself, your family, with the precious blood of Jesus. There is power mighty in the blood of Jesus. The devil cannot stand before the blood of Jesus. Release and plead the blood of Jesus upon yourself, upon your home, upon your entire household, upon your, upon your neighborhood. Everywhere, plead the blood of Jesus. Release the blood of Jesus into this nation. As that the blood of Jesus will saturate this nation and destroy every evil work and evil activities in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, cover the atmosphere and the airwaves with the precious blood of Jesus. Anything that has not been authorized by God to operate through the atmosphere of this nation, through the atmosphere of your home, through the airwaves of this nation, release the blood of Jesus on them to destroy them and burn them to ashes and command that the atmosphere is the atmosphere of God, the atmosphere of peace, the atmosphere of joy, the atmosphere of healing, the atmosphere of blessing, the atmosphere of love that we want to envelope this entire nation this entire nation, from city to city, from town to town, from village to village, from hamlet to hamlet, no where, no space will escape the atmosphere of God in the name of Jesus, including your home, to be, to be enveloped, your neighborhood to be enveloped in the atmosphere of God, atmosphere of deliverance, atmosphere of miracle, atmosphere of favor, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Miracle worker. You are a miracle worker. Come and do a miracle. A miracle today. You will do a miracle. A miracle today. Your name is Yahweh. Your name is Yahweh. You are a miracle walking God. Your name is Yahweh. Your name is Yahweh. Your name is Yahweh. You are a miracle walking God. 
Your name is Yahweh. Father, I worship you and magnify your name because your name is Yahweh. You are a miracle-working God. Thank you, Lord, for answer prayers. Father, our focus is on you this evening. As a child looks to the, to the hand of the parents for blessings, so also our eyes are on you, Daddy, this evening. That you will release your blessings, the blessings in your hands. As we focus on you, you will release those blessings into our lives. And we shall manifest them and give glory to your holy name in the name of Jesus. Lord, I commit your servant, your son, into your hands. That your anointing, your anointing in a greater measure we flow through him tonight to us. You will minister in your power, in your might, in your unction, in your wisdom, through him to us, O oh Lord, tonight. As you are using him to bless us, you will bless him in return in the name of Jesus. And together, we will all glorify your holy name. In Jesus' name, I have prayed. Amen. Amen.